I'm Jenny Baker and I work at Carolina Biological. Like many of you, I'm stuck at home with the kids. Here's a fun science activity that you can do at home to teach you about digestion. This is my budding scientist. Hi, I'm Jordan and I'm in third grade. Here are the materials that you'll need to complete your activity. A bowl with something starchy. We've chosen a hot dog bun, but you could use any type of bread or cracker, or goldfish, anything like that. One paper towel per participant. Water and white vinegar. And we've also put down an old towel so that when we squeeze out our food, we're not going to make a big mess. So the first thing Jordan's going to do is break the hot dog bun into small pieces. What are you trying to show there, Jordan? When you break it up, it's like when you're chewing your food. That's right. Now Jordan's going to add a little bit of water and tell us why she's doing that. When you add the water, it's like your spit when you're chewing the food. Now we're mashing it up, just like your teeth. Mushing it together with the simulated spit or saliva. Now Jordan's going to add a little bit of vinegar and tell us why. The vinegar is like your stomach acid because vinegar has a sort of acid in it. What's happening now? It's breaking down and it's getting mushier and wetter. So it looks a little bit like something that might be digested. Yes, it does. Now we're going to put that food that's been partially digested into the small intestine. So this is the paper towel. It leaves the stomach, it goes into the small intestine. Now it's going to get squeezed through the small intestine and the large intestine. What happens in the small and large intestine, Jordan? The intestines soak up nutrients and water. That's right. So you can see there's water coming out. These things are being absorbed by the body in our simulation. She's squeezing it through the intestines. Now we're going to open it up and see what's left. When you open it, the food is a lot drier and it's now waste. So we've followed the food all the way through to the digestive system, from the mouth with chewing, saliva swallowing into the stomach where there was acid, and then through the intestines where we absorbed water and nutrients and we were left with dry waste at the end.